So hello, welcome back to another video. I am very uh, nervous at the moment. I'm in this car park. Some of you may recognize. Um, I know I said I was going to the Quantox, but I had a slight change of plan midweek when Simon Warren released the new X list of 100 climbs. And there's one just the other side of the Quantox. So I thought I'm gonna drive the other side of the Quantox and I'm gonna do this X climb. Where do I know of a car park? At the bottom of Crocombe. This could be the hardest start to a ride ever. I'm going up Crocombe, I'm doing 70K, 1250 meters of climbing in all, just to tick off two climbs. But I'm excited because there are loads and loads of new roads. So <laughs> I am gonna have some fun today. It is a bit foggy up on top, probably driving over the top and down Crocombe is probably not the best way to start because that top bit is just ferocious. But anyway, let's go have some fun. Ride me bike and uh, not too cold. Been a bit of ice about this week, but it's not too cold. And hopefully it's not gonna rain. That was horrible. That was really horrible. But it's done. <laughs> so now we've got 69 kilometers of nice new roads. Ah. It's my day off as well. So we've got a little off-piste just to get some tiles and I've probably come too short anyway. It's incredible up here on Crocombe Common. Wow, just wow. And that got a little bit off-road, a little bit quickly. I was hoping I could just drop down to the road without having to go back the way I came. Yeah, there's a reason why there were mountain bikers coming this way. Good job I've got an all-road bike. <laughs> I think we'll just, uh, I can see the road on the map, I've just got to keep going. Hopefully won't fall off. <laughs> yeah, this baby said that they don't got a future, future like <laughs> Right, so this, oh, this last bit might not have been rideable, but that was a bit of fun. A bit of off-road <laughs> to start the day. Well, a ridiculous climb. And then a bit of off-road to start the day. But I do believe I found the road I'm looking for. <laughs> yeah. Now that's more like it. And that's why nobody wants to ride the bike with me. <laughs> but the explorer in me absolutely loves that. Look at this grid. Yeah, he's calling all his friends to get some action and distract him right now. He's fine, but Lucy on the line, let's get this started. Where's the party tonight? I feel good, nothing weighs me down. I can't believe my love right now. Red eyes while he said.
Oh, my average speed for this ride is woeful. I think it's about 16 kilometers an hour. It was 13 till I just did all that flat, but that's a huge climb up from Lilstock. That little road in Lilstock was beautiful. We we're heading back towards Holford now. I've got, well, this was supposed to be the bit of off road. This was supposed to be the bit of gravel I put in to try and get a tile at Holford to avoid the main road. So we've got some more off road. It looks a bit foggy over there actually, so who knows how much fun this will be. going too well that road was absolutely awesome I'm having a whale of a time and now it's turned into this um, <laughs> we're gonna have fun on this descent <laughs> I'm not surprised <laughs> I've come from there but luckily not very far I found a road because somebody actually lives up here so we're back on the road I'm always one step behind wishing I could read your mind but I'm ready yeah never ready I wish I could have made it stop The first time that you stood me up I wasn't ready Yeah, never ready Like a forbidden fool I'm still craving for I'm still one Right, so I'm heading towards Monk Silver, the bottom of this climb which is Nethercott Lane I think it's 3.5k long and it goes straight up there Oh, hello pheasant so maximum ramp of 15%, but I think it's about 6.8, I think. I think. I can't remember exactly, but I might have to cut this road short because it's taking so long. <laughs> These roads that I'm going off route for are terrible. Just going a little bit slow. But anyway, I'm having so much fun. Beautiful, beautiful scenery. What I didn't say was it was 15% for a long, long way. Uh, if all the exits climbs, I like that. Oh, what have I got myself into, eh? Uh, right, we have done now, it's 10 to 2. I've done 48k. <laughs> I still got 22k to go. Hopefully, it's down and a bit flat now. Uh, what climbing have we done? 11.33, I think it was only 12.50 in total, so... It's been a long old day on the bike. <laughs> oh, but I love new roads. Uh, new climbs? <laughs> I think I celebrated too early, it's still going up. I'm not at the top yet. <laughs> When the storm is raging in your head When you feel there's nothing more ahead The hills they seem all green but they hide all the monsters And you kept holding my hand as you reached for water On the hills by the lake you were chasing This is yet another stunning road there's a lovely little stream here, the West Somerset Railway Line's there. I think I'm just about to cross the railway line. So I think I'm stuck in some kind of vortex. Just every, every time we go around a bend, there's another hill to go up. 
and then there's a sign that says Crocombs three miles away. And I go around another bend and go down up another hill, Crocombe three miles. It's been three miles for the last 10, I think. <laughs> I just don't see you any closer. I can see it there. Oh, I'm done. Absolutely done. I know I've got a sandwich in the car and I'm so glad it's in there. So thank you to my lovely wife. I just need to get out. <laughs> Bike sounds awful. Every time I put it in the little ring, it sounds awful. I think it's as broken as I am at the minute. <laughs> well, what a day out though, what a day out. So about where we started, that was a very hard 70 kilometers. My average speed was 16.3. <laughs> and I've done 1,600 meters of climbing, I think I just said. 1,600 meters of climbing. How was that 1,600? Well, I know how it was 1,600 meters of climbing because I did it. That was so much fun, but it was so hard. So I hope you enjoyed the video. But we'll see you next week. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And you can even go onto the GCM page. Uh, you can follow me on there. I've got my blue verified tick on there and all my links to Instagram, Twitter, Strava and the YouTube channel are all on there. Those are very kind people at GCN. Um, but other than that, I'm broken. But I have a huge smile on my face because I have so many memories and I'm gonna love editing this video because there's so much great footage. But we will see you next week. Who knows what I'm doing next week. <laughs> <laughs>